Alright guys, I'm going to get a reading in. Um, this is just going to be whatever spirit wants to have come out. What's the drama? What's the bullshit? What's going on? What spirit needs to tell somebody about whatever is going on? Okay, well, somebody's spying. Somebody's watching someone. I don't know if someone's watching someone that's left out in the cold or someone who's left out in the cold is spying and stalking somebody else. What is this person trying to manifest? Okay, I've never seen this before in this card, in this magician card, but look at the, there's shadows um, on the back of this here. Like, where are they coming from? What are these shadows? Are they real? Or are they make-believe? Somebody wants to move away. They want to go to calmer water. Or calmer air in this case. There's a completion coming. Like something could be a success. I mean, there's two major arcanas out of the four. This could be someone's picking at something until they bleed. This person is immature. Literally, this person is, is going to keep poking, keep prodding, keep doing everything until. Um, they get their way because in their mind if they keep doing it if they keep if they keep um, annoying somebody or pushing someone they literally think that eventually they'll throw away this other cup and come back for them whatever it is that this person does not want to look for and they'll give them equal give and take then so they're stalking Someone seeing something from a different perspective. And this person is determined. Determined to stand up for themselves or someone they love against these secrets that had to do with this third party. One of which was their soulmate. they wanted to have victory with but they hurt this person and now they're having nightmares let me scoot these up sorry guys give me one second these these are one of my favorite decks I don't I haven't used I haven't been to use them even though I wanted to but they're just a little bit longer and I forget sometimes they're a whole lot longer than the other cards all right so this is giving this person nightmares maybe they're getting nightmares of the things that they did to this person and they want to ride in and they want to be the emperor for this person they want to be the stability that this person needs now. And they want to work hard for it. 
This person's willing to do the work. Under the deck, King of Cups. Three of Coins. Queen of Pentacles. Ace of Wands. Ace of Pentacles. Two of Swords. Someone is really controlling their emotions. I, I don't know if they're even expressing how they feel about this third party. Maybe it's like they want to say something, but they're not. They're not. They're purposely not saying what it is that they want to say about this third party energy. That could have came in between them and their queen of pentacles. They're loving, they're nurturing, you know, they're stable partner. It's a lot of aces. This person could have taken their wand to play with another ace, another For some people, this is choosing between love and money. Or the wish fulfillment. It doesn't necessarily have to be money. It could be, you know, choosing between like love or lust and going towards what is wish fulfillment towards them? They're stuck at this crossroad, you know? They can't move forward, they can't go back. But they need a balance. They were being told they needed to make a balance, to find balance. to do so they would have to walk away okay now with the eight of cups I'm gonna say this this is the way that I read the eight of cups someone is walking away from these eight of cups the cup suit comes in ten if someone is walking away from this eight of cups what are they walking towards what's left they're two of cups and in this case Someone is walking away from all these old opportunities to go towards their empress. Their two of cups. Because now we have the emperor to the empress. But it's going to come after a time of self-reflecting to find balance here. For this Ten of Cups, this happiness. That's what comes when someone finds the balance, when they move on from the past, what they will have if they're not too late, if they don't take too long. I'm getting some people are going to wait too long and they're going to miss it. They're going to miss the boat. What's the drama? What is the drama? I did not give you my time because I was busy giving it to someone else. 
I do not think this can ever work. I do not want to give into it. I am insecure and you trigger my ego. You scare me. I'm not motivated to do any work to keep this relationship. I developed a crush on someone else besides you and I have been flirting with them secretly. I am going to manipulate you every chance I get. This hurt my heart, guys. You cannot put boundaries on love. I do not like your personality. I know we are in a relationship, but I want to be single. coming out. What from this deck, Spirit? I miss you more than the moon misses the sun as it chases it around the world. Divinely guided. Hiding their feelings. I'm annoyed. I have not healed from the past. How could you love me? This person doesn't. This person isn't understanding why this person loves him. Because they're literally putting nothing into this relationship. They're not giving anything. The other person is giving everything in these. This person is giving nothing. Not only that, but they're manipulating this person and they know it. They're flirting with someone else at work. I don't know why I just said work. I think it's because I just did the work reading. Hopefully it's not. But they're flirting with someone else. Secretly. Someone else they have a crush on. I did not like this reading. Day, enjoying your time together, fell in reverse. This is a couple that is not spending time together working on their relationship. They're not doing anything. Even the bravest wolf hunts with his head down. This is kind of like that saying, you know, like if you're a fighter, someone's wore out. If you're a fighter, they tell you, tuck your chin. You know, you don't want to get caught on the chin. You don't want to get knocked out. This is someone who's going to get mad. Because... This person's 
possibly get a flirt with somebody else that's already taken. So somebody's flirting with somebody in a relationship. There's nothing good here then why dwell on it so much the world needs you all of you so stop focusing on the little things that do not matter bigger things are ahead make the move you deserve this in all the wild world there is no more desperate creature on the verge of losing love than a human This is somebody who literally is pissed off their their girlfriend. They probably have found out about this secret lover. You cannot control everything, but if there is something you can control, it is this. The education you open yourself up to. You can learn and become anything as long as you put the work in. This is someone who's being told, you know, if you wanted this... You would put the work in it's important to you you'll put the work in you'll be there you'll show up you'll put the work in that's just all i just keep hearing you'll put the work in brushing a girl's hair behind her ear once a day will solve more problems than therapists and drugs that was her magic she could still see the sunset, even on the darkest days. She still wants to see the best in this person, in this distorted masculine. But he's hurt her. He's hurt her bad, he's lied to her, he's crossed the line. masculine as in or it could be another fem it could be an, a female that's in this narcissistic energy someone wants to start a fight the darkest dark does not fear the brightest light. So why should you fear your deepest fear? None of that would matter with a little courage. It is in you. Find it and set it free. Okay, someone's being told to find their courage and to let something go. Even though someone's wanting to throw a fit and stay. But they know that this person literally lies. They tell half truths. And literally, they have many options. They make this person an option. transformation tree transformation happens after the wisdom comes in it's gonna come in through a connection through a friend through forgiveness I just heard no there's a possibility for a 
forgiveness, but someone doesn't want to forgive. Because this person is happy being mad at this other person. You know, it makes them literally happy for the other person who have fucked up so bad. perspective. Someone's seeing something finally from a different perspective or they're going to say they're seeing something from a different perspective. They're going to tell this story and they're going to tell the story filled with illusions. Yeah, they didn't see it from a different perspective. I didn't think so. This person is literally not healed. They're having a hard time with their identity. They're seeking answers, though. They're, they could be paying attention. Maybe they're paying attention to find out about the third party. Maybe they're trying to find out who the third party is. Because... Someone is awakening, or there's going to be a new romance that's coming in. Show me, show me wildflowers here, please, spirit. Why is wildflowers here? Better things are coming. Renewal. Radiant energy, the sun. of wands to the ace of cups this is somebody who could have energy they could be an energy vampire but that's the reason why I feel so worn out but this person is being called to lay back there's time for reflection that's needed the page of swords somebody's stalking someone Nine of Cups, Emotional Fulfillment. Nine of Coins, You Are Enough. Four of Swords, No Action or Movement. And the Moon, The Subconscious. of pages here. There could be children in the mix here. But somebody needs to take a step back to reflect on everything that's gone on. To see where their true emotional fulfillment is. And that true emotional feeling is within self. And how we're going to do in life for us. But literally it shows here that there was no action taken in the past. Sorry guys, they're running the thing in there. Um, tell me, will this person ever make a move to make things right with their true person, not the secret lover? Will they make it things right with their true person? They're making a plan. They're making a plan to make things right. 
they're not just going to do it. They're, I don't know if this is a good thing that they're making a plan or not. Tell me, will this person go after this secret lover? Oh my gosh. That thing is still going. Hopefully you guys don't hear it. Will this person go after the secret lover? There will be a completion. Someone's going to push through these boundaries. Some, literally both of these are like talking about breaking through. This is somebody who wants to get closer to this person. But spirit is warning. Or maybe it's not even a spirit warning to be cautious. This could be someone who's taken a cautious approach with this secret lover. Temperance and strength. Union and alchemy. Love vanquishes hate. Someone wants to go into union with this lover and have victory. And they're not going to apologize for it. They're going to protect what it is that they want. But this person is... The person who's going after the secret lover, like... They're controlling, they're manipulative, you know. So, in other words, whoever this person goes with, I mean, they end up losing in the end because this person isn't a good person. This person has, will have nothing when they go towards this other person. soulmate or the sacred love here. That is being tested. Because someone does not know their worth and they need to rest after everything that's went on because another tower is about to hit. Son of a bitch. Tower here talks about this injustice. So, what is not pausing? to see where they're too controlling in this situation. Someone does not pause to see it. The hermit. In reverse. Someone is not looking towards moving on at all or putting together a new thing. Sorry, I cannot stop yawning. Um, whatever this is, this story is, is wearing somebody out. <laughs> like really bad, really bad wearing somebody out. 
He was in there, sorry, please, spirit. Somebody who's collector of a body count. Literally, they're just somebody who uses everybody to say that they've slept with everybody. Who else is in this story? The masturbator. <laughs> Cancer and a divine feminine. The handsy creep. Who else is in this story, please, spirit? Libra. Someone from your soul tribe. Anybody else in the story, please? Pisces. Taurus. Aquarius. Satan with the fluffy kitties. Divinely guided soulmate and Scorpio. Alright guys, so signs we've got, we've got Cancer, Libra, Pisces, Taurus, Aquarius, and Scorpio. We also got a Divine Feminine in here. Or a light worker. Alright, that's what I have for you. Someone could do Reiki, Reiki the Hansy Creep. <laughs> Don't know why I got that. This person could like to fish. This person is into the occult. This person has a divinely guided soulmate who could have. When I see a dolphin, it reminds me of someone who's passed on. It doesn't have to be. This could just be this divinely guided soulmate trying to speak to this person in the 5D. Yeah. But now I can't even hold my eyes open. It's it's starting to hurt to be awake. Um, so that's what I have for you guys. I hope this helped. If you like this video in any way, shape, or form, please hit like, subscribe down below. Your love and support is greatly appreciated. Um, and if you hit that bell, then I will see you'll get notified, and I'll hope to catch you at the next video. All right. As always, stay weird. Bye. Stay.